Hello, Red Brick Productions here with another LEGO review. Today, I have two more of those LEGO Minecraft foil packs. The first one is Knight with Chess and Anvil, and the set number is 662309. It has 17 pieces. And then this one over here is Cave Explorer, Creeper, and Slime. It has 30 pieces, and the set number is 662302. Yeah, without further ado, let's take a little look at this. This is the packaging for the set, and when I first saw the packaging, I was confused because this just looks like faded out diamond armor. But now I'm looking at it, it does look like iron armor, but not really. I don't know, it's pretty bad printing. But as the set name says, this is a knight with a chest and an anvil. The anvil is a build we've gotten before, and you know, it hasn't changed. The chest is the old chest, which is interesting. I thought it would include the new flat top, but... You know, that's okay. Inside we have three netherite ingots, which is really cool and nice to get. And finally, we have a minifigure with full iron armor. And this is a minifigure we have gotten before. And you might be wondering how this came in that nether set uh, with the piglins. And yeah, it's the exact same minifigure. So you've already seen the torso. There's the back torso, and yeah, this is a cool figure to get, and it, you know what? I'm okay with them reusing it. I like getting a full set of iron armor, though. Yeah, unfortunate for them, though. I don't know if they'll be able to turn it into netherite. But yeah, that's really it for this set. Now let's take a look at the other set. Yeah, Lego gets super creative with these names. This is the Cave Explorer Creeper and Slime set. This is the packaging for it. Looks, you know, pretty basic, but yeah, this is the set. We have gotten this minifigure before. It is the Spelunker minifigure. However, this is one of my favorite Minecraft minifigures, so I am not complaining on getting another one, which is awesome. You do have an iron pickaxe, you have a creeper, and a cool little side build. You know, I don't hate this. I really like the slime that we get because, you know, it's always nice to get a cute little slime. We do have an emerald ore a lantern and just like a little bit of cave build to mine it with and you know what i really enjoy that and i think it's a cool little thing to add there's a lot of pieces in this five dollar set but now it's really it for the reviews let's take a look at the final verdict so both of these sets are high higher up on the minecraft foil bag tier list because they both include minifigures which are not exclusive but are different than Steve and Alex, but also include more interesting builds. I think getting the anvil with the chest is better, and I think getting the little terrain is better as well. Overall, both of these are great little packs for $5. I will say, building them can be a little challenging because there's no instructions. However, there's no leftover pieces, so you know you're not missing anything if you use all the pieces. This one is pretty easy to build, and if you really need help, a lot of the times, with the builds you can just look up past instructions that include those builds like if you need help building the anvil there's a set out there with an anvil that you can use this one's a little bit trickier but you know you can just look on the box well not the box but the foil bag and you can kind of get a feel of how it is but you know if anything it promotes creativity and so yeah that's it with this set overall both are great for um oh wait i just saw on brick link uh, instructions are available at Ocean Blue. So if you need instructions, they'll give you instructions. However, you can look up set uh, the, and you can just look at the bag. They're pretty easy to build. I did not know that. I, I just saw that on Bricklink right now. So that is pretty cool. But yeah, these sets are great. I love getting more minifigures that aren't Steve and Alex. And yeah, overall great foil bags. These are definitely better than some of the ones we've gotten in the past. And that's it for this video. And if you enjoyed this video, please consider liking and subscribing. I'd like to hear your guys' thoughts on these foil bags in the comments below. Do you guys have any of these? Do you have the magazines and stuff like that? But that's it for this video. I'll see you in my next video. Peace out. Bye.